Hello, thank you. That's amazing. Thank you. Thank you for having me back. Um, thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you indeed. Um, no, no, I do you know it's very, very nerve wracking because I did so well the last time and there's so many amazing acts and also because um, it's the final and I thought my boyfriend, my real boyfriend, not Dave, my boyfriend was going to be here to support me. Unfortunately, he couldn't make it due, due to the fact that, that he, he dumped me um, in December. Um, 2010. So, um, by email. Um, yes, it was, it was a group email. And, um, you know, I only do that joke because I, I can pretend I've had a boyfriend. And, um, and the other reason is because people say I'm sort of like uh, inspirational for autism and it's sort of... If, well... Basically, for those... For those who don't know what Asperger's syndrome is, it basically it means, it means I'm better than you. And, um, Seven claps. <laughs> Twelve. Um, Twenty-four. Eighty-nine. There you go. Um, and, and, and also, it means for me that I'm actually very good at music. I do come from a musical house. Yes, I live in a flat. <laughs> um, and in fact, uh, when, I, when I was young, my favourite instrument was this. Alicia, you're the musical one. Can you, can you tell me what instrument this is, please? <laughs> Me uh, come out because today isn't actually just the final, it's also the anniversary of my coming out. Oh, yes, thank you. Yes, um, thank you this. This, this time last Wednesday. Um, <laughs> and, and people say that for, for the final you should do something different, you should do something the same. I don't know. I've done enough songs about the panel and there's no more jokes left. So, um, well, so no, what I've decided to do is I, I want to do a song for specific people, so I need someone who, who's like uh, very old. Oh, Simon, there we go. Um, <laughs> I need two ladies, well, there we go. And um, I need s someone h hiding the fact he's gay. So, <laughs> so, right, so. <laughs> so, for the, um, the, uh, the, the third and final and last time, a song about the panel, this is to do with uh, coming out my, 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 to my mum. Here we go. <clears throat> Mum, you should have known I was gay from my school report. Stood for hours in the showers, never doing sports. <laughs> Drink a cup of tea, take some valley, and I'm almost as gay as David. Uh, this is a song for my mum today. I've got a song for your mum to follow. A song for David's mum. Your son will come out to my... Robert, you're not gay. Gays have fashion senses. You look like Donald Trump having a fight in Marks and Spencer's. <laughs> Your clothes are second hand with a busted zipper and they're all coming off like a leash of the stripper. No. <laughs> Good, that went down well. I thought the reaction might be bad. Like that grinder date where I accidentally met my dad. Um, <laughs> I go. Mum, I'm gay, I'm sorry, it's hard to take. I hide my bottom in a cake, so someone licks it by mistake. <laughs> you say I should be straight and have ruined your plan, but I can't marry Amanda Holden, even though she looks like a man. Oh. Oh, sorry. No, even though she looks like a man to hold on. <laughs> my mum goes, Robert, you're not gay. Gays dance better than you. When you dance, you remind me of Anne Whittaker having a poo. <laughs> But do what you want, there's no more waiting. What about Simon Cowell? He's the perfect age for dating. <laughs> Silver Fox, how, how old are you, Simon? No, uh, do you know what? I, I forgot. <laughs> there we are, all those old, old timers. Can't remember with Alzheimer's. No, um, <laughs> I, I've been told earlier you're 58. That's really great. The perfect age for dating. <laughs> Carbon dating. Um. <laughs> Who am I kidding? Simon was never my favourite. <laughs> the only one I ever wanted on Britain's Got Talent was David. <laughs> <laughs>